The Azerbaijani village of Lahij lies in a gorge of the Neil Mountains, about a three-hour drive west of Baku. The narrow cobbled streets, houses made of stones from the river, workshops and stores look just as they did centuries ago. Lahij has long been known as the village of artisans, with crafts including leather production and carpet weaving practiced here. But it is the coppersmiths that made Lahij famous. Highly ornamental, locally manufactured copperware is the symbol of this small village. This workshop is 300 years old. It was opened in 1725 and is still operational today. My ancestors, everyone in my family, great-grandfathers, uncles, their kids, they all worked in this workshop. I've been coming to work here from the age of five and every day since. Now I'm 50, and my children will be the eighth generation of the family to work here. Copper manufacturing is one of the oldest forms of metalwork. The practice of forming and decorating copperware dates back thousands of years to not long after people first learned how to extract this metal from the ground. And methods have changed little over the years. Local coppersmiths still use traditional tools like sledgehammers and chisels. This is hard work that requires strength, stamina and patience. Kevle shapes the dish from raw copper, covers it with a layer of tin and brings it to me. I apply the ornamentation. Each dish is unique. You can't keep applying the same pattern to every dish, each time it varies, always inspired by the shape of the dish. This chisel is the only tool I use. I don't even outline the decoration with a pencil. I always imagine it in my mind first, before inscribing it. Today, copper tableware made in Lahij is on display in some of the world's most famous museums, including the Louvre in Paris, and is highly valued locally too. Copper art in the Hij dates way back. We know for a fact that elaborate tableware was already made here in the 11th century. Apart from that, in the various regions of Azerbaijan, archaeologists have discovered copper coins that were manufactured in the Hij during the Middle Ages. We also know that in 1923, there were over 200 operational copper workshops in Lahij. In 2015, copper craftsmanship was inscribed on the UNESCO representative list of the intangible cultural heritage of humanity. <laughs> 